doubt the moral victory. It's not the right way to say it. There's no moral victories. We get that. But it's the idea of building out of the second half. They gave up less than 50 points a game. Their three ball for Mayer. No, but Wagner was wide open on the back side. So a 3 nothing start for the Eagles. Three ball, good from the corner. Ellen Hane, the grad student from Stockholm, Sweden. Hane gives it off on a good pass to get rid of it early. And Tanaya Henner, the senior, just one of six from the floor in the early going. Karen Sanford is in there for the first time. Phillips from the corner is good. Something that we have not really seen Boston College have to deal with this year. They really only have one point guard. And Timmerin, who took over for Tyena Mayer, nearly got a steal. Two to shoot. Phillips got home. And a great day is with you, Albany, here in Colleen Mullen. Take inside and the bucket for Ellen Hane. If you're Boston College, a couple of, you know, maybe situations where there should have been switches that didn't happen. There is Dontavia Wagner and the foul. Who then made the extra pass to Fatima Lee, the transfer from Providence. Good luck, but couldn't finish. Now Lacey takes and the foul. Gakdang, double team came. Gakdang did a great job to manage to get that ball over to Dontavia Wagner. Colleen Mullen tries to stop the Eagle momentum. And the runner is good. Yeah, we didn't get to see whether the plan was to double her for you Albany or not because Day Cortez had to go to the bench so quickly. And a block by Lacey. In stride, Wagner. Little strong, but Joe, Joe Lacey. Gets the call from the bench, makes the move. It's seven. Daly, free throw line, got it. And Boston College will take the lead at the end of one. And remember, Tay Cortez on the other side for you, Albany out with two fouls. Daly, similar spot to where she just made one and has another. How long Coach Mullen waits to bring Tay Cortez back in. Nice cut, Hane, and finishes at the rim. In the U Albany defense so far this afternoon, even playing man defense. Sanford got open and banks it in. And Timmerin. Had a piece of the offensive rebound, ends up down with Daly. Got room on the drive. That was great vision by Daly to see that opening, but couldn't finish at the rim. And Lacey gonna push the offense into a jumper and knocks it down. Ended up bouncing off the hands of Gakdang. Now Hane cycles around. Sanford long two is good. are going with some of those jump shots and they're working. So now you had the paint touches. Austin College shooting 58% from the floor. Really the one difference in this game, arguably what's keeping you Albany in it, is the fact that they've made three threes and the Eagles haven't made one. So acting inside. It feel like Boston College is up a lot more yeah, than six. It, it does. Well, there's a turnover there and Phillips will get two back. And remember, at one point, you Albany led this game as much as 15 to 5. So as Wagner gets the bucket inside, I mean, if you go from downtown to up six, with Tyena Mayer on the bench for most of this first half, they've done a really nice job running offense. That's a great look from Helena Heigerstrong. Ava McGee is in the game for Boston College for the first time. Here's Daly, got to the rim. 10 for Daly. McGee, one on two and was blocked. The Great Danes, it's a 12 point win for BC last year in this matchup on this floor. First ever between these two schools. Wow, what a block by Andrea Daly. Gakdang known as the 
shot blocker for Boston College most of the time. That time it was Daly who continues to impress with her game. Pane is also playing with two fouls and knocks down the fourth triple of the game. Three-point lead now, as you said, after 13 points from Hane. Mid-range jumper has been pretty kind to Daly. Wasn't there that time, but again, an unchecked offensive rebounder. A couple players haven't played yet that meant a lot, so again, it's just been a disjointed start to the season. Wagner, free throw line, jumper good. Hanner tries the back cut again. It was a better job defending it by Lacey, but... Heaps still managed to make the play. And that's a heady play by Heaps, knowing Lacey has the three fouls, can't be too aggressive or physical. First points of the game for Heaps, the transfer from UMass. There's a big shot to answer from Daly. And nowhere to go against Dontavia Wagner. Wagner on the run, and Calvin in a foul. Van Timmeren inside, and a good take by Ali Van Timmeren. You do feel like Albany's gonna have to hit a couple of those if they're gonna get back in this one. Mayer, wow, crazy shot goes. First points of the game for Tyena Mayer. Hane with 10 to shoot. And a gun back to you, Albany, running the timer down. Hane on the drive. By the way, DeCortez is back into the game for you, Albany. On a right down the lane. Gak Dang from the free throw line. And Cortez has done a nice job not allowing Gak Dang inside, but a nice slip screen. Question for you, Albany, right now is can somebody help Hane? She has 18 points. Phillips has nine. No one else has more than five. And, you know, Heps now keeps now with four points. Remember, Phillips had seven of those nine yeah, right early. away, yeah. so not a lot of help for Hane. There is Tyena Mayer, pull-up jumper for four. Oh, tough start the for them. Shock of the ACC this year. Final seconds, third quarter. Entrance, Gak Dang, got it in time! Like to just cycle it back around. McGee open three. Van Timmeren has an offensive rebound and a lane to the bucket. Van Timmeren just waiting for the offensive rebounders. Her defender was the one that went to double gag down. Iger Strawn with your first three point make of the game for the 40%. Hane was open again. That's the first time that back cut's been open in a while. Then you're 11 and four and you're kind of off and rolling. Iger Strawn is good. Nice look. Seven points. Bailey's up to 16 points for Boston College. Igerstrand is good! And this is down to a two possession game. Right back where we were at halftime. Gak Dang inside. Here in the fourth quarter. Igerstrand blocked by Daly. Oh my, but then it's thrown right back to Hanner, who makes with 90 seconds to go. Air open, three is good! One more look inside for Gak Dang. But that basket is up to 17 points, which is a new season high for Gak Dang. There's a three ball by Phillips. And Boston College will pick up victory number eight on the season. 74-62, the final.